Welcome back. Here you are taking a ride on Tatsu. That's right, this is my first review. You guys voted for Tatsu for me to review first, so this is what we're going to do. Anyway, first being a flyer. You pretty much board the thing uh, as you would an invert with those nice vest restraints. And I really quite like them. They're very comfortable, and you just kind of you flip back, you know, to, to the point where, where your back's facing the top of the track, or, you know, you can kind of picture it. Um, it's nice. You're in the flying position. You just dangle there from your restraint. Anyway, top of the lift hill, you you got this great view below you. You're pretty high up. Uh, I don't have a fear, fear of heights, but I'm sure people will get freaked out from this. And then you got the first drop coming at you. So that's right. I'm going to actually talk with the point of view because it kind of bugs me when people don't do that. Anyway, first drop is, it was all right. It wasn't anything crazy. It was a lot of fun. You know, just kind of dangling there, going fast. You soar up into this nice corkscrew. You know, the sun goes, gets into your eyes. Going to the first zero G roll of a flying coaster. Uh, no whip to it like an invert or Kumbo would. A uh, fun horseshoe just to feel like you're flying. That was a really fun element. And some more twisties. And then the how to the ride where you pull uh, something like four Gs. And it's, it's nice to stay in G forces. You know, you really feel it. I love it. It's the pretzel loop. They're pretty awesome. They have a trim brick on the bottom, which is interesting. Um, yeah. And then you go through a nice inline twist. And then you feel like you're flying a little bit more, you know, you just kind of glide over Six Flags Magic Mountain, which is actually a pretty, a very pretty park. I really quite like it. And you soar into the brakes there. I wouldn't say you soar, but yeah. So that was a pretty quick review. Yeah. I know. I, I, I just go with a point of view. and that That's kind of a better way to do it, in my opinion. So you can really see it as it happens and how the elements are. Hopefully, yeah, I, I think that that's pretty fun. Good stuff. And let's just talk a little more about the ride here. So there's a dual loading station, so it makes for better operations. As you can see, that there's a transfer track, which is pretty cool. Yeah, so you got that. And yeah, there, there's the video. But um, transfer track, so better operations than, than it would because it's a flying coaster. you got to flip back, and it takes a little bit longer to dispatch. Uh, the restraints are a little more complicated, I guess. Not really. Kind of it's just the same as an invert. with It's, it's not really vests, but they're nice. This is the first one was 2001, I think, right? Uh, anyway, enough about that. That was Tatsu. Uh, I give it a 9 out of 10. I'll be doing that after the review. Just a little, little number. Uh, very good B&M. It's my number one B&M, actually. Uh, I really enjoy it. Still haven't written a hyper, though, that I'm looking forward to. So, yeah, that's Tatsu. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time.